vintage motorcycle days since I was a kid with my family, watching the racing, the swap meet, all the activities going on there. And uh, this year I had the opportunity to race in the hair scramble and thought I'd give it a go. So I've just been trying to get ready for that. Yeah, so this is an 83 Husqvarna WR250 that is from my dad's shop, Wheel Sports, that he started back in 1977. So he started with Husqvarna. And this is a bike that he got back and now I'm riding, riding on. I think it'll be all over the board. Of course, you're gonna have the really fast guys out there going for the championship. There'll be a lot of guys and girls just racing to have a good time. And that's really what I'm gonna be doing is going out there and just having fun and trying to stay out of the way. <laughs> They're similar in a lot of ways, but different in a lot of ways. Um, obviously, brakes, suspension, turning. Um, no electric start on this bike, and uh, so kickstarting it can sometimes be a challenge. It's on the left side of the bike, so you actually have to stand off the bike and kickstart it with your right leg. So the biggest challenge might be just keeping the bikes running. These are vintage bikes. A lot of them tend to break down. I think I have a pretty good mechanic, so uh, hopefully my bike stays running. Or if I do go down, that hopefully I can get it up and running again um, using that Kickstarter. But uh, hopefully the weather holds out. It's usually great weather for vintage days, so hopefully it stays that way. <laughs> so my mechanic is my dad. He's also my riding coach. Uh, he really helps me out with us. Uh, going riding. I've been riding since I was a kid. It's been really good for him and I to go out and spend time riding together now that I've graduated college and, and working for the AMA. You know, you're probably going to be nervous for your first race. I'm a little nervous, but I know it'll be a lot of fun and uh, I'm excited to do it. I'm trying to get out and practice as much as I can, um, but obviously with working, it's, you know, a couple nights a week or on the weekends, so I think it'll just be a really good time. So if you guys want to find out how I did in my race, I will be giving a presentation in the AMA Motorcycle Hall of Fame tent on the infield on Saturday afternoon at 2 p.m. And I'll be giving a, an update on what my first race was like and hopefully encourage some other people to give it a try in future years.